Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. After you have entered or edited text or made any change to a document that you want to keep, you should save the document. When you save a document for the first time, you must use the Save As dialog box. When you do this, it gives WordPad a location to which the document will be saved as well as a file name. Be sure to give it a name that you will remember, and also be sure to remember where you saved it. You can access the Save As dialog box by simply clicking the Save button that appears in the Quick Access toolbar at the top of a previously unsaved document. In the Save As dialog box that then appears, you can navigate to the folder where you want to save the document. Then in the File Name text box, you can enter a name for the file. Then click the Save button within the dialog box to save it. Now once you have named the file and saved it, its name will appear within the title bar. When you go to Save Changes in the future, Note that you will not need to use the Save As dialog box. You can save changes to a document that you've already saved before by simply clicking the Save button in the Quick Access toolbar. You will not have to re-enter the name and location, as the document will save itself automatically to the same place with the same name, overwriting the older copy. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www dot teachucomp dot com forward slash free.